hey everyone welcome to brand new web design tutorials okay this is not a series but if this video gets too long i'll probably cut into multiple parts and put into the playlist okay so watch out for that okay so uh, as you see in the screen we have a simple nice blog type of design for home page design of simple blog it has header menu with nice little effect and a sidebar and recent post with few post in it and a footer so as you probably guess this is not for the advanced web design user but this is for new web designer who wants to sharp their skill and who want to test their skills if you are unable to design on your own then you can watch this video with me or follow along with me in the video Okay. so I'll also have few challenges for you and I will be giving that challenges at the end of this video so watch out for that also uh, also I have created a one two extra pages here for login and register so nothing fancy but just to give you an idea of login and register pages okay so let's get started with the video I want to start with creating my separate directory for this project so I'm going to my desktop create a new directory let's call it as um, simple blog okay. now I'm going to open this in my sublime text okay let me close this out first and open folder desktop I have simple block okay now inside this folder I'm going to create two new folders one for CSS another one for images okay it will be really nice that if you put everything in separate folders so that it will be it will look nice and manageable okay so let me create uh, index of our blog that is index.html okay and I want to put my CSS file inside this style.css okay. now let me create the escalation of HTML welcome to our blog okay. now I'm going to link the CSS Now we can write this style here and all the style we write here will be applied in this uh, HTML page. Okay. So I want to start with creating few division. Okay. For let's say this is our main division which is called as container. Inside container uh, we are going to have header, navigation, login, uh, sorry this recent post field and footer and sidebar okay so let me create the division for all that first thing we are going to create it header uh, given the class name as site header okay I'm going to put the uh, that uh, navigation inside this header let me create a division for the content class site content and for have a paragraph tag with few text with and copy okay let me put put few text inside it so that we'll get to know where are these division are created so let's just call it as site content okay and this is how Okay, let me check it in the browser okay this is what we have got right now now I'm going to apply a few CSS here okay body margin 0 
padding 0 it will remove all the margin and padding and unnecessary margin and padding from the page and also I want to give background color as simple gray okay so let's check if it is working or not yes as you can see here all these uh, CSS are applied successfully now uh, let's see we have a header with a background color of black add a text with name uh, with the name of simple blog and the color is white so let us uh, create that header first okay so let's go in the header section i want to put that header in one separate div and inside this i want to give one h1 called inside title simple blog okay simple blog okay. also here uh, we, we are having this uh, main uh, container in the middle of the page and we are having few margin at the top and also few margin at the left uh, sorry bottom so in the container let me give max width of 90 rm and margin of 1 rem auto so what 1 rem auto does it it will give uh, 1 rem width at the top and the bottom uh, what auto does it it will center the page at the center of the page center of the screen okay so let me go ahead and see here okay as you can see here it is working now let me give the background color of white and also you can notice here we have few uh, box shadow nice box shadow for this container so i'm going to give box shadow of a box shadow for container rgb a this will give nice effect to the center of the container the container okay okay let's design the header part now uh, we have a site header class so site header background is black that is 000, zero, zero. Uh, okay Go and check. Let's see. Okay. Inside navigation, I wanna have a uh, UL order list with the class name of list. Okay. Inside that, I wanna have list item with the class name of list item. And inside that, a link. link let's call it as home this is link for home okay so i'm going to copy and paste this few times for other thing let's say this is for post this is for categories and this one is for video okay you can notice that uh, there is two part of this navigation menu okay the left part and the right part so left part is home post categories and videos and right part is login and register so i'm going to put that right part into the separate division and let me call it as right and i want to paste two list item here and that is for login and another one is for register So I'm going to style this uh, list item and list now. Let me refresh the page and see how it looks. Okay, this is the initial looks of our menu. Let me go ahead and design. Let me put small notice here. Menu styles. Okay. But this comment will help us to un uh, understand from where the styles of menu is starting. So this is a good practice guys. You can do this. Now, uh, 
uh, for navigation okay navigation you can give background color of I'm going to say green okay uh, let's see yeah it is green now now list let me style the order list ul i have given the class name of list i want to remove the padding and the margin from the uh, margin from the uh, list okay so it will look like this okay now from going to uh, style list item okay list item and as well as list item a because our uh, menu is inside uh, list item there is uh, okay, let me show you uh, inside this list item we have um, a link here a okay hrf link so i'm going to uh, refer that by using list item a because the a link is inside the list item now I'm going to first remove the text decoration to none. Uh, the meaning of text decoration none is that it will remove the underline from here. And also I want to give color of white. I want to give font size of 20 pixel. Okay, and this list item I'm going to display this inline block so it will inline the all the okay now it looks good 0096 is the color code for that nice color okay okay now it's good okay now i wanna give background color whenever we hover this link i wanna give the background color of white this item column on hover I want to change the background to white okay let me check if it is working okay as you can see it is working whenever I hover the list item that is list item hover I want to change the element of color of element A so I can write list item hover A so let me change the color to the should work now let's see yes now it is working but I have here some nice animation so I want to give this animation here uh, in the list item in the parent element of this hover and this hover I want to give the transition okay for list item a transition all one second okay and in list item oh, sorry transition of all two seconds so whenever we hover the list item the background color change will take two seconds and the uh, text color change will take one second so, so it will give nice effect let me show you yes okay this is nice and I want to change the color to white yes this is what I wanted now the next step is to uh, put this side content and sidebar side by side okay as you notice here this there is two part here one is sidebar part and another one is present post part so I need to float these together and uh, side by side okay let's do that now okay i noticed this video is getting really long so i'm going to split this video into another part okay so just check the playlist and play the another part of this video we are going to design and float this sidebar and side content in next video okay see you in next video guys